будем трудиться. Pro-Russian miners gather into next Wednesday to show their disdain for authorities in Kiev. The rally follows two days of fighting in the city between Ukrainian forces and pro-Russian separatists. A situation Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov says is pushing the country to the brink of civil war. Those who pursued that policy were not at all concerned that the wedge that they try to drive between different branches of European civilization is being driven across the Ukrainian people, and in essence that people are being pushed into the abyss of fratricidal war. In the self-declared republic, the barricades are still coming up. Some are living in fear. Of course I'm afraid. My parents called me last night and said they were in the basement because they heard the sounds of jets and shooting. We don't know who shoots or where they shoot. Nobody tells us anything, and we don't know anything. Government forces killed dozens of rebel fighters Monday and Tuesday in an assault to retake the airport, which rebels had seized the morning after Ukrainians overwhelmingly elected Petro Poroshenko as president.